This spinning top can spin for hours and hours, as long as you have it connected to a power supply. Let's see how it is built. The spinning top is nothing more than a pulley that I got from an old cassette recorder and it has a couple of neodymium magnets in the lower part. The magnets must be perfectly collinear with the center, otherwise will be unbalanced. The top spins on this mirror, it is a concave mirror and the reason for this is to help the top to stay near the center and do not fall over the edges. Let's see what's inside the container. We only have a couple of coils and a reed switch. So it is essentially a pulse motor. When one of the magnets passes near the reed switch, this closes and energizes the coils and the magnets try to align with the coils. But then the reed switch is not close to the magnets and the coils are not energized anymore and the top continues to rotate because of its inertia until the other magnet closes the switch again and it gives another push to the top. So this process repeats every half a revolution and maintains the spinning top in rotation. The position of the reed switch is critical. It must be close enough to the center to feel the magnetic field of the magnets, but not too close because otherwise it will stay on all the time. And also it must be closer to one of the coils than the other. But this is easily adjusted by rotating the lid of the container. The circuit is extremely simple. We have the two coils in parallel and then this is the reed switch and we connect the positive of the power supply here and negative here. The coils are made with magnet wire size 34 AWG and I used these plastic bobbins for sewing machines. The number of turns is not critical. Just fill the whole bobbin and you are ready. Okay, there you have it, a spinning top that lasts four hours. I think it is a great desktop toy and since it is using five volts, you can use a USB connector and plug it to your desktop computer or laptop. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.